Hey Toy Fans, welcome to a LEGO Super Heroes review here on Toy Review TV and of course it is Batman. This is the all new 76013 Batman, the Joker Steamroller which will cost $49.99 to purchase here in the UK. This does look awesome, how cool is that. Very excited to build this and show you all. We do get a Batgirl, Robin, Batman, the Joker and we get a Goon minifigures included in this. Let's take a quick spin to the rear where you can see the set in action but let's open this up and see exactly what it can do. And here we have it all constructed now included with this we get one sticker sheet with only three stickers on it so that isn't too bad at all and as normal we do get our comic insert which is a really nice thing about these DC and Marvel and superhero sets we do get these comics which is always a nice little touch and we do get two instruction manuals included now our five minifigures let's start with Batgirl oh yes this is the first time we have had a Batgirl, she does come with a Batarang and she comes with the purple cape and the Bat headgear as well with the reddish hair sticking out to the rear of that. So let's have a look at the headpiece there. We get two face prints on that and we do get some really cool detail to the torso. If I lift this cape up a little you will see we do get a rear detail as well to that minifigure so very very welcome addition to the Batman range we do get Batman lots of Batman minifigures of course because we have to get Batman with a Batman set comes with the Batarang the black cape the headgear again and we do have as normal one and two faces printed on there we have the front torso detail and we do have the rear also detail as well now on to Robin looking very short you have to feel sorry for Robin sometimes just come with the small legs we have the stick as well for the weapon and there is the face with the black hairpiece and we do get one and two face prints on at this minifigure I do really like that minifigure actually some of the detail on it is very good the torso detail is nice. We do get the yellow, tiny, tiny yellow cape. And we do have the rear torso print as well. And here we go. Batman's arch enemy, the Joker, does come with the banger gun. And the Joker face print is usually very good. And it is still very good on this minifigure with the front and rear torso detail. And we have this really cool purple hat as well there is the one face print you get with this minifigure always like the detail on Joker and we get the uh, obligatory goon we must have a goon if we have a Joker he has to have a henchman or a goon now this does come with a, cr a crowbar with the torso detail which can be seen there and on the back it says the Joker destruction it's crossed out the CON on construction and put destruction. That is a really nice touch to this figure. We do have the workman's helmet as well. And the face print is really good. I love the henchmen, Joker's henchmen. They always do come with some nice features. Now on to the Joker's vehicle. We'll go with the steam roller. So let's have a look at the steam roller and how cool is that? Very chunky. Love these rear wheels with the hypnotic looking wheel trims we do get the roller at the front this just feels like a really chunky solid vehicle we do get the joker bombs as well which are flick missiles those will come out of there you can just push that at the rear and the joker bomb will come flying out I love this smile as well how good is the smile to the front very cool we have the steps at the sides as well which to get into the steam roller there is the engine section at the rear and we have ample room in there as well to sit your joker or his goon minifigure there with the steering wheel lots of room inside there you can get joker and the goon in there even more you could also get some more henchmen if you did have them we have the translucent windows there as well 
and uh, you can get the minifigures in the side but if you wanted to remove the top you can and uh, it will be a little easier then to get your minifigures in from the top if you need to do so and then you can just clip the uh, roof section back down but there you go that is awesome massive thumbs up for that now we do get the bat wing as well with this I do love a Batman vehicle they are so stealthy and sleek now we do have a really cool uh, function with this underneath here we have a part of that you can pull back but you can actually pull it back up the wings as well if you want to but I find it probably best to pull it back on the underside and you can see it working fully if you pull it back there and what happens it will open up like that and we have flick missiles to the front some lights as well and that is all operated by these arms and this underside portion as well but how cool is that the bat wing you have the engine parts you have some nice detail there to the rear as well and we also have our cockpit so you can get your Batman figure in there, we have the seat arrangement and we also have these dials, now you can actually move that so you can have the dials at whichever angle you want to and that is a printed brick one sticker is applied to the front with the Batman symbol there but there you go, some nice translucent parts as well, red and green to the side but we do have this awesome feature, these are flick missiles so you can actually operate those if you want to, we have four of those and you can actually use that as well to grab a minifigure so if you had the Joker in front of you, you could swoop down grab the Joker and pick him up, let's try that out so let's try and pick the Joker up with this, see if it works shall we and there you go, we have the Joker and we can now fly off and take him back to the Batcave or even down to the local Gotham police station well there you have it guys one awesome set two really cool vehicles and we do get some really awesome minifigures included as well especially fond of Batgirl in this one well as always thanks for dropping into this review please do feel free to rate comment and subscribe and I hope to see you all here next time on Toy Review TV